hallo und herzlich willkommen zur Close Beta von Dirty Bomb. Das ist das neue Spiel der von Splash Damage, die vorher Brink gemacht haben, was ja leider nicht so erfolgreich war. Ich leider nie gespielt habe, obwohl ich habe, aber ich habe es nie gespielt, deswegen bin ich umso interessierter, ob denn Dirty Bomb vielleicht, ähm, vielleicht mal ein bisschen größerer Erfolg wird, weil Brink leider nicht der Erfolg war, den sie erhofft hatten. Ich habe noch gar keine Ahnung, habe mich damit noch gar nicht beschäftigt, deswegen würde ich mit dem Tutorial mal direkt anfangen. Und dann schauen wir doch mal, wie das hier so funktioniert. Oi, Skyhammer! Come over to the station entrance and I'll let you in. So, los geht's. You want to do mercenary work in the contaminated zone with us? Fine, let's get started. First off, I need a mugshot for our records. Look up at the camera. Okay, so have you brought your own weapons, primary and pistol? Show me. Nice irons. Now let's see if you know how to use them. Go on, Skyhammer, come on in. The CDA turned this tube station into a training facility for emergency volunteers. Once everyone was safely evacuated out of the contaminated zone, we, uh, borrowed it. Well, it was going unused. Und so, also von der Story ist es so, dass es äh, in London spielt und hier wohl etwas kontaminiert ist. You mercs all have different tactical abilities. Sky Ammo, I see you can resupply ammo and your unique ability is to call in airstrikes. Well, since your airstrike won't work quite so well indoors, how about you throw yourself an ammo pack on the ground instead? Yeah. Give you, there we go, ammo resupplied. There's a few mercs on the roster that can resupply ammo, but the airstrike ability is unique to you, Sky Ammo. Okay, let's start off easy. Shoot the static target. Nice work. You're also carrying a melee weapon. It'll come in handy if an enemy gets up close and personal. Defeat that target by using your melee weapon. You're a natural. Next up, moving targets. When you shoot the first target, the timer will start. Shoot as many as you can before I call stop. I might even add in some melee targets for you to stab as well. Fire when you're ready. So, dann schießen wir jetzt mal hier die Dinger ab. Na. From side to side, movement will keep you alive. You hit over 15 of them, that's good. Ah, yeah. So. During evacuation, you might encounter injured civilians or persons in need of medical help. Help them up. Caution, do not attempt to help up the injured while you yourself are under fire. Ups a daisy, there we go. If you can give out ammo, do so. Lives depend on it. Give the nice dummy an ammo pack. Good. 
You use your ability to give ammo to your squad mates. The other mercs will use their abilities to give you health, deploy goodies like turrets or sensors. Everyone has a different ability. Squads that use their abilities together best win. We're done here. Head on through the next door. Contamination pumps must be maintained to avoid buildup of radioactive gases. In the field, you might be required to repair various bits of equipment. Now repair the extractor fan. Repair that extractor fan. Yeah, yeah. Must be nice by the way, say. Extraction fan repaired. Good. There's still plenty of contamination left in the evacuated zone. Okay. Oh, that's not good. You're taking damage. Yeah, that's smackish. Thank you. You're down, but you're not out. Your squad mates can help you up if they can get you quickly enough. If you keep taking damage, you'll be forced out of action. But you'll be back on the field a little while later. Uh, Skyhammer, I'll be right with you. I just have to deal with another recruit, Aura. She patches people up and shoots them. Could be a handy hey. addition. Can respawn. Welcome to the combat medic test. Please head into the med bay. Aura, combat medic. Good. Head to the med bay. Good stuff. Glad to have you with us. You may encounter individuals no. incapacitated by radiation, disorder, or the appropriate use of force. Use your defibrillators to stabilize the incapacitated dummy. Revive that dummy. Reviving is quicker than helping up and more effective. Excellent. That will get a fallen squad mate up on their feet pronto. Anyone without defibs can help them up, but it takes longer. Getting them up is only half the job. Aura, your unique ability is to deploy a portable health station. Stick it down so we can sort out our synthetic buddy. Wow. Well done. Deployables aren't bulletproof, so tuck them out of harm's way, all right? Masterful. Now head back across the walkway. You need to sprint. You'll need to move fast under enemy fire. Fine sprinting. That'll come in handy. Hunt. Plant a C4 charge in that container. C4 time fuse is always 50 seconds. You do not want to be next to it when it goes off. Oh, so it is. Any C4 charge you arm, the enemy will try to disarm it. So don't let them. Ah, oh. Some mercs use specialized PDAs to disarm C4 a lot faster than others. So if you're defending a charge, they'll be your priority target. Oh. You're alive. Bleeding marvelous. You're in. Okay. So, wir haben also jetzt gerade zwei Mercs freigeschaltet in dem Tutorial. Jetzt gucke ich mir doch mal an, was hier unter Mercs zu finden ist. Karen Squad, okay, hier sind die, die ich derzeit ausgewählt habe. Den besitze ich aber noch gar nicht. Die Aura haben wir ja gerade eben freigeschaltet. Die könnte ich kaufen, ist sicherlich. Ok, 
Okay, den habe ich ja auch eben gespielt. Skyhammer. Mal noch mal, was es hier noch so gibt. Okay, es gibt hier wohl irgendwelche Loadout, ähm, Loadout Cards. Aber dann wird man wahrscheinlich einiges freispielen müssen. Auf jeden Fall ist es, glaube ich, das Spiel wird auch free to play. Deswegen sieht man hier überall immer, wie man denn hier Geld ausgeben darf. Okay, dann so viel zum Tutorial und in der nächsten Folge werde ich dann mal die erste Runde spielen. Bis dann.